I'm Julie. And I am Heather. And we are with Shiny Garden, and we are currently at Costume Con 42, going on at the Hyatt Regency in Aurora. Um, we are having a blast here with all sorts of costume programming, as well as costume contests. Um, it's been an incredible event so far. The theme this year is oh, yeah. the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Yes. Um, since it is Costume Con 42, and the answer to everything is 42. Yes. So, Life, the universe, and everything, 42. So, so. We, that is our theme, and we are, are uh, a heart of gold. Mm -hmm. And um, everything you see is kind of golden around here these days, as we are having fun with our, um, our costume contest. Our first one was last night. And we have Drag Brunch tomorrow. Yes. So we have lots of other main events going on in addition to our regular costuming programming. Yeah. Um, we also have... Um, so th this is special because it's a traveling convention. And what I mean by that is every year it is in a different city. Um, so we never know exactly where it's going to be till people sign up to have it hosted in their city. So Denver won the bid, and so we are now having it here in Denver this year, which is great. Um, but it's special because it's not an every year con at Denver. So this year it's being hosted by Shiny Garden and WhimsyCon, um, but it's special because it's traveling, and so we never know where it's going to be, and this year it's here. So we bid on it, and we won, and it's been great. Next year is in Wisconsin, so we're yes. super excited for yeah. Costume Con 43 next year. Yes. Um, they're still ironing out some of their details, um, but we'll be happy to talk to you about it if you go to CostumeCon43.com. Yes. Um, the other thing is Shiny Garden does put on other events. We are a 501c3, so we're a nonprofit. Nobody on our staff is paid whatsoever. Um, we do this out of um, the passion in our hearts for people and loving people where they're at. And um, so Shiny Garden, as, a, as the broader company, we put on other events. We put on Hexacon, and we also um, put on Whimsycon. Um, we used to do a Malcon, which might be coming back. That's Myth, Myths and Legends Con. Um, we also have some other events in the works, so please stay tuned for that. We're super excited. We haven't announced to anybody yet, so we're not going to announce that yet, but they are in the works, and, uh, but we always have volunteer opportunities, not only with the board at the board level of Shiny Garden, but also at the events themselves. We have so many spaces for people to come in and volunteer, and if you volunteer with us for anywhere from 10 to 12 hours um, over the whole weekend, then you get a free badge. So it's an easy way to get a badge and come in. Um, right now at Costume Con, we actually have a deal going on too, where if you bring in, a, if you find one of the flyers in the area and you bring it in, you can get a free, free badge that way too. So please don't let money be an ob objective to having you come. We can make that happen. We have a whole bunch of, um, what are they called? Scholarships. Yep. We have scholarships available for everybody. So please come, please come. Part of Shiny Garden that we are very proud of is we cater to our community and our community is very diverse and we uh, do our best to bring opportunities to everyone and that includes financial, financially. We want to make sure that um, the cost of a ticket isn't prohibitive for you and we, we just want you here. So if that's a problem, come talk to us and we'll, we will work it out. Yeah. We just want you to here to be with our family so that you can become part of it. And our true core belief is we want to provide a home for everyone that doesn't feel like they necessarily have a, a home in their fandom, whether it be in costuming or in magic and lore, which is your myths and legends, steampunk, which is your whimsy con. We want to make sure that you have a place that you can be yourself and be with other like-minded individuals who love the same things you do. Yeah, so we're definitely open to everyone and anyone coming to join us um, and have fun. Um, we're, we're definitely one of those uh, places in town where you would call, consider us a safe space. Um, if, if there is anything that does go on, we try and make sure that it's, it, we can turn it into a positive experience instead of a negative one. So if anything does happen, please come find us. But yeah, we're, we're here to support the community in whatever way we can and make sure everybody has a safe, fun place to hang out and geek Have out. Have a good time. <laughs>
there's always, sorry, <laughs> there's only so much that a small group of people can do. So the more voices that come into the conversation bring other perspectives and you will have other um, opportunities that I haven't had for whatever reason. You know, you lived in the East Coast, I lived on the West Coast, and, and so we didn't necessarily get to go to the same events and see the same things. So you bringing your voice to this conversation gives us new perspectives and new ideas and, oh, we haven't tried that before. Let us see how we can bring in your new perspectives and make a new opportunity because Julie might not have ever seen it either, and neither has our community. And, and how can we help grow our community? And that only comes from other people. It, we can't live a sheltered um, existence with just it being a few people. The more, the merrier. It mm -hmm. always helps. Yes. So to be a volunteer, you can either go to shiningarden.org or to the event itself, um, costumecon42.org, and um, and just there's a tab that says volunteer opportunities, and you just go in there type in your name and information, and boom, we have you. Then you come in to the event, and there you are. If you're signing up for the board, then we reach out to you via email and, and start conversations and, and see where we go. We meet once a quarter, so it's not a major obligation. Um, we meet for, like, like, like I said, once a quarter. It's usually on a Sunday. And it's usually most of the day, most of the day simply because there's a lot of business to discuss, um, but it's not a massive time commitment. Your bigger time commitment is gonna be at the events. So I just want to thank everybody for coming. It has been a huge experience having this wonderful traveling event come to us. And we are so happy to have you. And seeing all the smiling faces out in the, uh, out in the event space is amazing. All the beautiful costumes and the, the time and energy spent yes. is just phenomenal. I mean, we've even got the quilts going on and the dolls. There's just so much here. It's been so incredible. So we thank everybody who has put in any sort of time. Like you, the people that come is really what make this makes this possible. And you will find so, lifetime friends. So. Yes, lifelong friends forever. Mm -hmm. It's great. So we're but super thank happy. you. And yeah, thanks for being interested. And thank you for the opportunity to talk to you today. Yes.